everyone! In today's software video, we're going to explore the PProf Profiling Tool, a fantastic utility shipped with the Go standard library. We'll be running this tool on a GitHub example included in this video's description. Let's dive in! The PProf Tool is a powerful resource for analyzing the memory and CPU capabilities of your Go applications. It allows you to examine various aspects of your program's execution. To access the interactive CLI tool, you can use the go tool pprof command with a URL of the endpoint in your application. For instance, if your application is running locally, you can use the following command. Go tool pprof http colon slash slash localhost colon 6060 slash debug slash prepof slash Alex. Alternatively, you can provide a locally stored CPU or memory profile to your PProf tool. We will start by exploring the Alex space. When you first use the PProf CLI, the help command is your best friend. It shows you all of the available commands. Please explore these commands at your leisure. Additional documentation for these commands can be provided in the PProf GitHub page linked below. I found the top command to be the most valuable when exploring profiles via the CLI. It provides a wealth of information about your program's performance. Once inside the interactive CLI, we will be using this top command to examine the historical memory profiles available through the Alex endpoint. Two important aspects to consider are the flat and the cumulative. Flat represents the profile of the function itself, while cumulative, abbreviated CUM, encompasses the function as well as the children functions that it calls. This information can help you identify memory-related issues. After analyzing memory, you can exit the Alex space and enter the heap space using the CLI. Here, again, we can focus on the flat and the cumulative usage for the heap. These profiles show live memory allocations and can help you monitor for issues with your garbage collector or diagnose um, what we like to call memory leaks. If you exit the heap space and enter the thread space in the CLI, you can here explore the flat and the cumulative values. In this particular program, we should only see one thread, which means that only the main thread is being executed against the operating system threads. And there you have it. We've explored the PProf CLI tool, ran it on an example project, and highlighted its powerful capabilities. Remember, profiling is an essential part of optimizing your GoPode. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more software-related content. If you have any questions or suggestions, leave them in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and happy coding.